What's up guys, how you all doing? For today's video I got eBay mystery box. I ordered it a month ago when the trend was actually pretty strong. Everybody was doing eBay mystery box from a hundred bucks to ten thousand dollar ones. So I thought I'm gonna jump on that trend too. But it took almost a month to deliver it to my house since I bought it. So the trend is not as hot anymore but that's okay. I honestly thought I'll never see my five hundred dollars or my mystery box. But we finally got it. So let's unbox it and see what we got. It's a lot bigger than I expected. I honestly expected $500 one. Mystery box would be something like this big, but not this huge. So let's open it up and see what we got inside there. Boom. Whoa, look at that, this is huge. I got here a letter. Well, there is a letter and right here it says Crazy Russian Hacker. I guess he googled my name or something and he figured it out who bought the mystery box. So, uh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a good one because he knew that I was the one that they bought the mystery box. A little bit chicken, but it's okay. This past month of putting together this mystery box is easy one of the most memorable moments of 2017. I am sorry for the weight of you had to endure to this was all with good intent. Well I understand, he googled who was buying the mystery box and he really meant to make a really good mystery box. He also included a little USB flash drive that he made a video for me, but do not send me USB flash drives, I'm not going to use them because a lot of them has viruses and stuff, I'm not taking that risk. But anyway, check this out, this is all vintage stuff. So there is some kind of vintage logo right here. Let's see what else we got here. Very well packaged. Alright, the first one. The first package, man, there is a lot of stuff. There is a little vintage plate, I assume. It doesn't really say who it was produced by on the back. So maybe I'll Google it, what that plate is all about. Okay, let's see what else I got. Oh my gosh, look at that. This is a Hellboy 2 running type actual movie on a tape. This is Hellboy 2. This is a trailer, is for motion pictures that has not been rated. I don't really have movie projector, so I won't be able to watch this movie, but nevertheless, I'm pretty sure it's pretty collectible. Okay, let's see what else we got over here. No way, what is this? Whoa! Polaroid lens camera. This is crazy, I never even seen a camera like that. Looks like there is no cartridges inside to take pictures with, but that's pretty cool. Vintage items, you know guys, I like vintage stuff. Okay, let's see what else we got here. I love opening stuff. Whoa, what is that? Some vintage spark plugs. I have no idea what this is. Some kind of bolt. And there's some crazy vintage spark plugs. Interesting. You guys should let me know in comments below how much these things are worth. Is it gonna be worth $500? You should guys do the calculation for me and send it to me if it's going to worth exactly the $500 that I spent on this mystery box or more. So I'm figuring it out. Looks like there's full stuff of vintage items, which I like a lot. I do love vintage stuff. Maybe some of the cool stuff, I'll keep it around here. A whole bunch of plastic bags. It feels kind of heavy, but let's see what's inside. Man, how many plastic bags are there? There you go. Finally, let's open it up. Oh, it's, I think it's a hammer. Don't you guys think? It has to be some kind of hammer. Man, it's packaged so well, I love it. Make the video longer. Oh, what is that? This is a, some kind of award, I think. No way. Whoa, YouTube craziest, crazy Russian hacker. Man, this mystery box Turn into personal mystery box. There you go. It's pretty heavy. Thank you guys. I got an award for being YouTube's craziest. It's like almost a fun mail unboxing. 
Oh, it says fragile. So I gotta be careful with this one. Man, there's so much stuff, I can't believe it. I think it's gonna be worth $500. Meta piece kit, some kind of musical instrument or something. Let me know in comments below, what the heck is that? Maybe I'll read the e Maybe I'll read the mail and figure it out, but it looks like some kind of musical instrument or something. Anyways, let's see what else we got. There's a little vintage sign, American Telephone and Telegram. Let me know in comments below how much does this sign worth. Here's a little rusted on the back, but I know those vintage signs worth a little bit of money. So you guys should let me know in comments below, calculate everything and how much do you think all this stuff worth together. There's a little vintage picture, who is that? I have no idea. Also let me know in comments below. Okay, what else we got here? This is probably gonna be the coolest piece right here. This is some kind of poster. Whoa, let's find out what it is. Might have to hang it in the studio if it's something really, really cool. Whoa, oh my gosh, this is so, whoa, there's so many. I cannot wait to show you guys. I'm gonna show you one at a time. Check this out, movie posters, and they are original. This is so cool. That's so crazy guys, look at that poster. I'm gonna hang him all over in the studio, I might, at least some of them. Look at this poster right here, so awesome. What is that? Is this like supposed to be cut out cards or something? Cause look on the other side, it's some kind of cards that have not been cut. That's pretty epic for sure. Also, let me know in comments below how much is this each poster is worth. I think we're definitely going to make 500 bucks. Wow, look at this poster, man. It's huge. Avenger, Age of Ultron. Check this out. Oh my gosh, it's also signed. Who is this signed by? Let me know in comments below also. That's so amazing. This is huge poster. I will have to actually hang it somewhere in the studio probably because this is super cool. Whoa, this one is cool too. Oh my gosh. This is uh, Caesar Hands. I watched that movie actually. I liked it. There's an old movie. I watched it when I was a kid. Look at that poster. This is sick, man. This one is not signed poster, but nevertheless, it's amazing. Boom, there's more posters on the wayside here. Wow, this is awesome. Series premiere, 21st Hulu. Boom, Clock and Dagger, and it's by Marvel. So cool, man, so many cool posters. And 3D glasses, I think. And what else we got here? Ooh, we start out with some cool vintage items. It was like, ah, oh, it's okay, it's kinda cool. But this poster makes everything amazing. Wow, which one is that? Jessica Jones, Marvel. Jessica Jones, Marvel, season two, coming 2018, Netflix. This is cool, I love that this one is already framed. Very, very nice. No way, this one is actually signed too. How much do you think one of this worth? Framed and signed. Super cool. That's pretty cool, I never seen a gadget like that. You can turn your boring case into this wooden piece. Anyways, what else we got? There's one more thing right here. Honestly, I think it's worth easily $500. I think money spent well. AT&T on this side, so another pretty vintage piece. I have no idea what it does. 
What is that? Let me know in comments below. This is so weird. Let me show you close up. This is like a bonus item. It's AT&T on this side. And when you press it, it makes a weird noise over here. Oh yeah, looks like one more thing. I thought it was over. Almost missed one more thing. It was in here. Looks like empty box. What is this? American's first space age world fair. Oh, this is so cool. A little vintage Vegas. I love everything about space, so this is pretty cool. I wonder what this is, like maybe like a bath bags or I have no idea. April 21st, October 21st, 1962. So also pretty vintage bags. Okay guys, one more time. I lay everything out. What I want you to do is calculate how much everything is worth and let me know in comments below if it was worth $500 or not. As you can see, everything is vintage out here. There's American telephone and telegraph vintage sign. There's a little still working AT&T piece, which just kind of freaks me out a little bit. Super weird, never seen anything like that. Some vintage plate, I guess. It has no markings on the back. I have no idea what that is. Some little weird part, some kind of automotive part, I have no idea. And this weird box, I don't know. It came with some weird musical piece. Maybe it's some kind of musical vintage instrument or something. Dog and cat food together. I never seen that before, that's kind of funny. Jessica Jones, Marvel season 2 coming in 2018. So it's pretty new, but I think it's signed. So that's cool. Square Shooter 2 Polaroid camera. This some kind of celebrity vintage picture. I have no idea who that is or how much it worth. Couple vintage spot plugs. And the coolest parts that I really love. Is this some kind of cards? I have no idea that it was supposed to be cards. Let me know in comments below. This is super cool. I think he explains it in the letter. Maybe I'll read it later. This runaways, little poster right here. Clock and dagger, I think. Free form coming in 2018. So that's pretty new stuff. Caesar hands, I really love this little poster. It's very well done and as you can see it changes colors on the side, the pipes are there. That's a beautiful, beautiful poster. So right here everything about the movie. Love that poster a lot. This poster is super cool. Carnage Marvel. Don't think this one is signed anywhere but I really love this poster and the paper is amazing on them. And Avenger, Age of Ultron. Look how amazing quality that is. Let me know in comments below who it's signed by. Also, there is a tape of Hellboy 2. Let me know in comments below how much is this thing worth. Well guys, that's pretty much it. I know that Catherine gonna love these Marvel posters a lot. So I'm gonna give it to her. She's gonna be pretty excited about them. So honestly, to me, money well spent. I'm really glad that I got a good mystery box. But anyways, let me know in comments below. Was it worth $500 or could I got everything a lot cheaper? And as always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up this video, and I will see you next time.